afternoon. This is Sensei Yu. It is Wednesday, April 8th. So happy to actually work out with you guys tonight. I'm going to do full gi because tonight we're going to work on all of our kata. Um, I'm going to do one of my favorite workouts, which is to uh, really get the heart rate up, but also focus on the strength of our stances and our foundation. Um, when we, we talk about building a house, we don't build from the rooftop first. We always build from the first floor of the basement, which is your stances, all the way through the core up to the top. Okay, so tonight we're going to be doing three kata in a row. The first kata of the series will be the foundation, the stances. Then stances only, no hand movements, just hips and down. Making sure your heels stay on the floor, making sure your knees are bent and your weight is distributed correctly. Then the second of the same kata will be both uh, stances and waza or technique. And the third one will be for, and that one will be done slowly so you can have a chance to kind of correct your technique. And the last one will be all of it together, focusing on technique, speed, and power. And also a kind of a cadence, so I'll be counting for you in all of the cases. If we're ready to begin, I'm going to actually put a timer on so that when we are not doing kata, we're also going to be doing active rest. So either a minute of a plank or a minute of push-ups, and you're going to follow me. In, in between each of the minutes, we're going to have a 30-second rest. So don't worry. You will get a really great workout. If you need to and pause, you can go back and do the katas that you know and not do the other ones that you're not as familiar with because we're going to be moving pretty fast through each kata. So first, we're going to do hand shodan all the way up to hand godan. If you can stay with me, we're going to do this all in a 30-minute period. I promise. All right, here we go. Starting with a one minute work warm up with me. Let's go. Jumping up and down, hands in front. Go set left and right. Keep moving. We're going to do this for 15 seconds, side to side. Keeping your feet shoulder width and then knees bent and um, knees soft. Okay, side to side. Okay, good. Put your left leg in front, left hand up, shoulder high, right hand here by your jaw. Keep your, uh, if you're looking straight ahead and you have no mirror, you should be able to see both hands in front of you. Okay, elbows are close to the ribs, but not touching the body. Good, next side, right leg forward, right hand up. So it's the same motion side to side, except that you're going forward and back. Okay, just warming up. Side to side, forward and back, okay? Last 15 seconds, gonna get you back to side to side motion. Hands in front, don't let your hands drop. I know sometimes we need our deltoid muscles to keep our hands up. That's why boxers have to do a lot of upper body work. Keep those hands up. Good. Number three, two, one. 30 second rest. Catch your breath. Take a deep breath in. Stretch. And exhale. Deep breath in. Stretch. And exhale. One more time. Deep breath, deep breath in. Stretch. And exhale. Okay. Hands on top of your heads. Hands linked together. Go to your left side. Stretch. Keep your ribs nice and high. But bend over. And the other side. Stretch. Bend over. Good. Now we're going to do alternating lunges for another warm up. From here, I will turn to the side. You're going to take your left leg forward, drop that knee, and back. Right leg forward, drop your knee, and back. Left leg forward, drop your knee, and back. Make sure that step is long enough so your knee is over your ankle and not, not in front of it. And back. Forward, stretch. And back. Forward, stretch, and back. Now we're going to do the same thing, but we're going to step backwards. So stepping from the front, step back with your left leg, back and forward. Right leg back and forward. A little bounce there. Back and forward. Back and forward. Keep going. Stretch. Drop that knee down. Stretch. Drop that knee down. Stretch. Back. Stretch, back, we can get one more in on either side. Good, 30 seconds rest. From here, this time I want your feet twice as wide as your shoulders, hands out like an airplane, come halfway down, stretching your legs, good balance, breathe in, exhale, breathe in, exhale, put your hands to the floor. I want to hang here for about 10 seconds. All right. All right, from here, one minute. 
make a horse riding stance, kiva dati. Five seconds have passed. We're going to take this right leg, straighten it out, make front stance. Back straight, hips in, kiva dati. Five seconds. Other side. Back leg straight. So my heels and toes are still on the floor. My toes are pointing the same direction. Keep it at you. Five seconds. Switch. Back. Switch. Back. Switch. Back. Switch. Back. Switch. Back. These are like two second intervals. Back. Back. Switch. Back, keep the same height, switch, back, switch, go straight ahead, knees out, butt down, switch, and relax, excellent. Now, last warm-up section, hips around in a circle, big circle, go the other way, good, switch again, other way, knees around, other direction. One more time. Out. In. Then and push back. Just a little bit. Awesome. Okay. So I'm going to repeat what we're going to do in this class. We're going to do hand shut on first. Hand uh, three times. Then hand knee down three times. Hand sun on three times. Hand yon on three times. Hand go down three times. If you can't do a kata because you haven't done all of it and you don't know the sequence, Pause it and repeat. Go back and do hand children again, okay? So we're gonna start from the beginning. We got 30 seconds to go. And then there's gonna be a 30 second rest. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this opportunity just to review with you what I'm expecting from your stances. When you're in front stance, your feet should be shoulder width, your toes and your balls of your feet and your heels should be on the floor. This way, okay? And when you're in a front stance, your one foot that's in front is two shoulders, one, two, ahead of the other one, still staying shoulder width. Front knee is bent. When I look down, I cannot see my toes. My back is straight, hips are under, heels are down. Okay, stay with me. All right? And then, if I'm facing you, that front stance will be shoulder width apart. When I move through my front stance to another front stance, I don't move the front toes. I put enough weight in this front leg that it will pull as I push the back leg. When I come down, my heel does not land first. I try to put my whole foot down, ball the foot first, feels it, and then you, you land and sol solidly connect. Okay, you mean to connect with your stances. All right, here we go. Hand shoulder. Be shoulder width, just stances. One. Stay the same height, step forward, two. Step back, front leg. Three, turn. Okay, hand or fist, front stance, four, second four. Okay, coming towards me. Left leg four, three rising bars. Hip is back, but still in the front stance. Hip is back, front stance. Hip is back, front stance. Back leg comes around, front stance. Stepping forward, sit back, front stance. Looking the other way, shoulders are over the hips. Stepping forward, front stance. Turn to the and we stand back to where you started. From stance, punch, punch, punch. Get it. Make back stand for me. So this looks like a keep it at you, but your weight is on the back leg. Let's say keep it at you, weight is on the back leg. Diagonal, second one, turn, and last one forward. That's your back. That that is hand show done. Only stances. So we're gonna take a quick 30 second break. The second time we're gonna do it, we're gonna do a downward block with the hands, rising block with the hands, hammer fist and all that, okay? Get your breath, 10 seconds to go. Feet together, ready? And feet, you are. Enjoy! One down block, punch. Turn down block, hammer fist, punch. Still good stances, right? Feet come, downward block, front stance, but your hip is back. Open this hand in front above your head, grab this imaginary hand, break. One, two, ki three. Hey! Turn, downward block, punch. 
Sit back, down block, punch. Down block, sit back, punch. Two, three, punch. Here, okay, stands here. Back stance, back down block. Keep the hand always above the elbow, right? Third one, reach. Last one, left hand on top, reach. Good. That's our second one. Let's, okay, the third one's gonna come a little bit faster. I'm gonna turn this way so you can see the full cut though. Okay? Making sure it's easy. So now, perhaps a little bit easier to follow. We do cut them in 10 seconds. The angle is down just a little bit. Okay. Okay. And two of you should be able to follow me. Eight. Knee. Seven. She. Go. Rip. Squeeze. Feet. Squeeze. Head. Yeah. Hey. Because contract, contract, expand. Me. Sun. She. Just punch. Go. Coming back towards you where you started. Rub. Square out the head. Punch in the center. Sit. No step on the nail. Let's. Hey. Back stance. Shoulders back. Knee. Sun. She. Okay. So there I took 49 seconds. It's a little bit longer, a little bit slower than our normal pace for hand show done. Our cut, the hand cut, this should be 30 to 40 seconds. So now you have a 30 second rest. If you wish, you can repeat hand show done or pause, pause and go back. Or you can stay with hand done with me, okay? So hand done, I'm gonna do stances first. This cut up focuses on back stance. So let's get our back stance is correct, all right? Weight is 70% or 7 tenths, almost 7 out of 10 weights on the back leg. Here we go. Hey, Nina. Drop. Left leg is out. Two and three. Other side, four. So you notice I turn my toes from here to here. Five and six. Half step, toes in the same direction. Lift the right leg. Kick that back and look to the front. Okay? Stay the same height. Back stance. Back stance. Front stance, Ki. Hey! Turn like the last four movements in hand shoulder. Back stance. Back stance. Back stance. Back stance. Back stance. Now make front stance with the front leg shifting. Do you see my back hip? Push in. Here. Kick. And then shift. Kick. And 74 front stance. Here. Okay, back leg is down, toes are still pointing forward. Turn, back front stance. Front stance diagonal. Front stance. Last one, front stance. Okay. When I come back, Zanchi, my eyes will be facing that direction. I'm come up slowly, face the front. This. Wait 20 seconds till the next repetition. So this time, I'm going to do Dachi with hands. Uh, Dachi, stances, and the Waza. Okay? I'm still facing you. Stay with me. Four or seconds to go. And back. And you go. We'll do this in 40 seconds. It. Knee, son. Notice. Shoulders level. Good he can take. She. Turn my toes. Turn my eyes. Go. Rook. Open that hip. Shoulders down. And half step. Lift. Kick. Snap back. Right hand block. Left hand goes on top. Right? Me, sun, ki, she. Hey, turn. One, two, three, four. Now use this back leg, drive in. Go. Keep this elbow tight, this one here. Kick, snap back, punch with the left hand. Left hand to the front, walk. This elbow stays here. Kick, snap back, punch. Stepping forward, walk. Right, I'm back to where I started. Think about down block. Rising block, right hand. Right hand, right leg in front. Right hand in the down block again. Last one, rising block. 
Eight. Seven, eight. Feet together. Now. We have 20 seconds to the next kata, the final one, a hand showed up. I'm sorry, hand knee done. And I'm going to face this direction so you can see the movement. Okay? Follow me. 10 seconds to go. We can do this. Okay. Hey, you go. 40 seconds. That was 42 seconds. So, took an extra second to turn around face you, but that was 40 seconds. That was a good kata for timing, okay? So, kata does not need to be rushed. Each movement can be fast and powerful, but it does not have to be a jumbled mess, okay? Excellent. Get your breath. All right, here's our 30 second rest before we go to hand on that. If you wish to pause and just review hand shot on hand, you know, this is your chance to stop the tape and go back, all right? I am going to catch my breath before I start hands on with you. Ready? Can you stay with me? We're going to do hands on on just the dachi, just the stances. For this one, I think I will turn this direction to help you see all the stances. All right. Okay. Let's, let's get started. Yoi. Hands on them. Back stands first. One, feet together. Two, three. Four, feet together, five, six. Back stance, one. Front stance, two. Spin, feet together, keep it at your knees out, three. Front stance, four, five. Stand on up. Right knee up, keep it up. Left knee up, keep it up. Right knee up, keep it up. Stepping forward, front stance. Step shoulder width, turn, keep it up. Now push with your left leg, slide with the right leg. Right, right leg is down. Feet together and bow. This. Okay? That took about 50 seconds because I wanted to set it up slowly for you. Let's do it again. Here's our 30 second rest. Starting now. Think about it. So toes are straight ahead. Your feet are two shoulders. One, two, right? And you're pushing your knees out. Okay? That's what helps you tuck your tailbone under. Tight belly, tight back, shoulders above your hips. Okay? That's your hands on top. That's your keep it up. That's your hands on top. Ten seconds to go. This time I'm going to do with Dachi and Waza techniques. Okay? Keep those hands nice and tight. Go ahead. Okay, so That's the underneath. Back seat. One, two, three. Other side. Four. Right hand underneath. Five, six. Feet together. Right? Block one, back stance. Tight front stance. Screw in. Calm down, keep it up. Camera fist. Four, yeah. Hey. Stand on up. Right knee comes up to protect the chest. Knee up, down, back fist. Knee up, down, back fist. Knee up, down, back fist. Reach, tuck day. So fingers are straight up. There's a 90 degree bend here. Touch. So total is turn. And kia. Hey! Right leg comes in on me. Feet together and down. Awesome. Okay. So now it's 10 seconds to go. I'm going to take a 30 second break and then I'm going to show you where you can follow me. I'll face that way. Okay. All right. Here comes our 30 second break. Remember, fluid. Stay the same height, but Settle and squeeze. I'll tell you where to squeeze, all right? Try to, maybe the timing will be a little bit off because my voice doesn't carry quickly into the video, but try to squeeze every time I'm saying squeeze, okay? What I mean by squeeze is inhale and exhale. <clears throat> Tighten here, squeeze your hands. That's what I mean by squeeze. Down, okay? Okay, 
And kind of and then squeeze. Squeeze here, right? Squeeze, squeeze. Relax. Squeeze. Here. Squeeze, squeeze. Breathe in. Squeeze. Front stance. Squeeze. Turn. Keep it out. Your knees out. Squeeze. And T.I. Squeeze. Then relax. Stand all up. Right knee up. Down. Squeeze. Back fist. Left knee up. Down. Squeeze. Back fist. Right knee up. Down. Squeeze. Back fist. Relax. On the punch. Squeeze. Turn. Squeeze. Push with the left leg, relax the right. Hey! Yep. Feet together. And back. All right. A little slower than 40 seconds, but that's because we slowed down so you can keep up. Um, the next 30 seconds. This is your time, chance to pause the video and go back to a hand show done, knee done, or so done, or just do hands on and over and over again. Um, or you can follow me. We'll do hand yoga. Take a quick breath. How far are we along? Hmm. I can't even tell how long we've been doing. Oh, we've been doing 24 minutes. Perfect. All right. Eight seconds to go. Seven seconds. And you're done. Facing you. Okay. Follow along. Just, just the stances first. Dachi. One. Settle. Settle. Sit down. Two. Settle. Gather. Front stance. Three. Back stance. Four. Gather, five snap back, front stance. Half step, gather, snap back, front stance. Okay, I'm gonna back up a little bit so you guys can see me. From here, turn, pivot, front stance, kick, don't go for high, go forward. Squeeze your knees together, no space between your legs. Turn, back stance. Kick, snap back, front stance. Back stance. Kick, snap back, front stance. Three back stances, one, two, three, front stance, me up, hey, turn, back stance, last one, coming forward, back stance, yes. Awesome, okay, let's get you done. Give me 30 seconds rest, catch your breath, we're gonna do it again, this time with the legs and the stiff wings. So when we do um, YouTube live, it's live. There's no breaks. We keep going. Here we go. Yeah. And you're done. Like a handkerchief. Down. Two. Sharp. Three. Four. Lift. Five. Step back. Six. Step back. So my left elbow is in, right? One, two, kick forward, hey! Turn, really flat, so small angle here. Kick, step back, punch, punch, other side. Keep your hands up. As you kick, keep your hands in front. Kick, step back, punch, punch. Three blocks, three, two, one. Back leg is gonna power this move, grab. Ear width, breath, get it, hey! Night hill walk, night hill walk. Yummy. Get together, yeah. It was awesome. 30 seconds rest, I'm gonna turn the other way so you can follow. And then we'll be done with hand, doing that, number four. For this cut, they keep your eyes up. Try not to go up and down, try to drive. Drive from the core, like someone yanked your belt and it's going. Okay? Follow me. Three. Go straight ahead. Hang on, go. You are. Breathe in. Drop out. Look the other way. In, out. Front stand. Back stand. Then you kick. Right elbow's hitting the left target. Other side. Look to the front. One, two. Kick, step back. Push forward. Hey. Turn diagonal. 
Keep your hands here. Kick. Punch, punch. Other side. Kick left leg, punch left right. Three blocks. Three, two, one. Grab those ears. Yeah. Hey! Forward. Down in. Step back. Now, ideally, you should have ended where you started. Time to take your 30 second break. Again, if you only know up to here, pause, go back to doing the katas that you want to do. Hand shodan, nidan, sanan repeatedly, or just do hand sanan and yonan if you want, or just do hand yonan if you want. Okay, 15 seconds, and we're going to do hand goran. This time, let's start facing this direction. And ready. And go down. Back stance. Punch. Hip is in. Pull your right leg up. Looking at your right side. Back stance. Hip is in. Pull facing the front. Right leg forward. One. Left leg front stance. Two. And block. Pull down. Hammer fist. Yeah. Hey. Right knee comes around to protect your chest. Knee up. Knee back. Look to your left. This time. Hit the hand. One, two. Legs together. Jump. Or prepare for the jump. Make sure your right leg is lifting, but your left leg is also tucking behind under. Front stance. Turn. Low front stance. Pull back stance. Stand up. Turn. Front stance. Pull back stance. You notice I went here and I pulled my leg a little bit. That's okay. It shows me that you have momentum going back. Got me. Wait. Catch your breath. 30 seconds. And try to stay with me, right? Don't don't pause it now. Catch your breath in 30 seconds. Breathe in through your nose. Hold. Four, three, two, one. Breathe out. Four, three, two, one. One more time. Breathe in. One, two, three, four. Hold. And out. One, two, three, four. Should we calm down? This is what we call box breathing. Okay. Right. Here we go. Gachi and Waza. Eight. Good. Walk. Back stance. Long punch. Pull the left hand. You can take it. To the right. Same thing. Right hand underneath. Walk. Punch. Pull with the right hand. And face the front. This is a hook punch. Right hand hook punch. Block. Uchuke. Or, sorry, augmented. Um, Morotoke. Jujuke. Up. Pull down, hammer fist, yeah. Hey! Right hand is up to your face, right leg is up front. Back up. Left hand underneath, look at your hand, hold yourself in that. One, two, three, lift. Both bring both knees up, right leg in front. Front stance. Turn, grab, pull. Stand on up, turn. Front stance, back stance. Yummy. Feet together. Yeah. Was, all right, that was definitely more than 40 seconds, but I would slow it down so you guys can see. And the last one we're going to do with me facing this way. Should follow me. 15 seconds to catch your breath, and we'll go. I didn't realize how hard it was to talk and to teach. And to move. All right, I'll stop talking. Hi. Notice the feet. That's just important. And go down. It's me. Side. It's me. Side. It. Me. Side. She. Go down. It. Me. Side. She. Go. Run. Lift. Hey. Front stance. Turn, front stance, pull, back stance. Stand up, this is called Manjuke. Turn, front stance, back stance. No ki out here, the ki out is at the top of the jaw. Yummy. Feet together, back. There we go. So we're done, we were done in 40 seconds, and we're gonna ki uh, rest for 30 seconds, and we'll do a warm, up, warm down together, okay? Woo! 
All right, we start our 30 seconds. Um, next minute, we're going to do a butterfly stretch, a side to side stretch, and a hamstring stretch. So in the next 15 seconds, we'll catch your breath and breathe out. If you're not done with your workout and you'd like to repeat hand go down, you can pause now and go back. Otherwise, join me in a warm down. We're going to first sit down in a butterfly stretch. So your heels are together, pull your toes in, and without bouncing, I want you to push your right knee down. Exhale. Push your left knee down. Inhale. Exhale. Pull both heels in. Breathe in. And push down. All right. From here, you're going to keep your left foot in place. Right knee's going to come over. Right? I want you to actually put your weight on your knee and push forward. You feel it stretching your hip, maybe in your ankle, but definitely stretch out. Now, if your right leg's in front, grab it with your opposite hand, and I want you to hug that knee in towards your chest, stretch through your hips. Look over towards your hip side, stretch. If your heart is thumping, I want you to take a deep breath in, hold it for four count, breathe in, two, three, four, hold, four, three, two, one, exhale. Good job. Okay, come back to butterfly. Take your left knee over the top, hug it with your opposite hand, and look in the direction of your front leg, okay, the top leg. Breathe in, hold it for four, and exhale. Four. All right, so the box type style breathing, think of sides of a box. There's four of them, right? Relax and exhale for four counts. Right? Hold it for four. Nothing happening. Breathe in. Keep breathing in. Hold it. Four, three, two, one. Exhale. Not fast. Four, three, two, one. If you can control the exhale, what's, what's happening is your mind is overcoming your desire to just right huff and puff but huffing and puffing is caused by a buildup of carbon dioxide in your body and your body's desire to exp expel that exhale that so you're trying to just take deeper breaths in deeper breaths out that's your cleansing breath okay one more time you're gonna keep your heels together and I'm going to turn to the side. I want you to try to relax as best you can. I know that, that stupid buzzer is going to go off, but I want you to open your hips up. Lower your spine to the floor. I want every time you breathe in, I want you to imagine your knees getting closer to the floor. Imagine your belly button dropping through your spine to the floor. One more time again. Imagine that buzzer's not going to go off. It will. Excellent. Good. Knees together. Roll yourself up. And we're going to bow out. We'll call this the end of our training. Get together. That's great. Thank you for joining me for the 530 class. I'll start the 630 in just a moment and have that online for you guys to work out. We'll do another set of kata in my favorite my favorite training method, which is the dachi first and the uh, uh, waza after. Have a good night, guys. And next week, remember, we're not gonna have uh, classes after Thursday this week because it is Easter weekend, so Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, no training. But Monday, we want you all in your geese. We're gonna have you live on video. We're going to use a technology called Zoom. A lot of you have been hearing about it. Maybe your parents are using it. Maybe you're using it to say hello to your friends who are stuck in their homes. But we're going to use it so we can give you feedback. You'll be able to say, hey, Mia, try to fix that stance. Hey, Marley, that's a great back stance, but why don't you put, a, put your back heel on the floor? Or, um, hey, Mr. Paul, your, your hand's open or you're leaning a little bit. So we can give you actual feedback. So we hope to see all of you guys in the next week's classes. All right. Have a good night.